Hey, it's Brian Shannon from alphatrends.net. Let's take a quick look at Ethereum. This first chart we see uh, is constructed with four hour candles. Each one of these candles represents four hours of trading. I anchored a volume weighted average price from the all time high, and this is a level I've been referencing for the last month and a half or so as that first bounce from the sub uh, 2000 level came almost precisely up to there and then turned lower. It made a higher low, rallied back up, found supply once again, and then again over here at that same volume weighted average price. What I did subsequently was draw a volume weighted average price off of this low because that's obviously an important level. And what we can do is just to change it and well, let's not do that. I was going to make it blue. But anyways, it's this one right here. And then a volume weighted average price is off of this low and this peak. And you can see what we just happened was after the last test of the volume weighted average price from the high, we undercut this prior little band of support, which is now becoming resistance. So traditional technical analysis, this prior support acted as resistance but that's also the volume weighted average price from these three anchor points and we fell from there now let's quickly turn the uh, time frame to a 15 minute and what I'm going to do is add a volume weighted average price from that most recent low and let's just go back to the uh, so that's the low that was occurred about a day ago well we saw that on the way you know as it undercut the 2300 level uh, it came down, tested the volume weighted average price from that low, tested it again, tested it again, and then today we undercut it. Now we're here kind of looking like a fractal of the prior time frame. That is that that prior band of support or that level that was holding as support, that volume weighted average price, now seems to be holding as resistance. So for uh, Ethereum to really become uh, positive again here. There's that volume weighted average price from that low. We're going to need to get back above 2620 to become neutral. To become positive in, in this market, we're really going to have to get and, and hold back above really this level up in here, about 2800, 28 to 2900. Until it does that, I could still consider Ethereum to be in corrective mode. And uh, we'll see where it goes from here.